Ayo, Chicks here. Today we're going to do some wolves again. So basically, um, we decided to switch up our teams a little bit. So um, in my server, there was someone asking, hey, could you please try to just remove the festival Gotha and replace it with Lilia? So the cool thing about Lilia is basically um, she also has a drain, which is also AOE, which means sometimes when um, the wolves have the taunt up and you need to drain, sometimes you just can't drain. With Lilia, it is possible. Um, also, you have a passive healing and uh, not passive healing. You have a healing with also potential cleanse if it's a two star also with a pierce increase for meliodas the only problem is um she does not have a single target so um the thing is though also our festival gotha his debuff card it is completely useless so i would say um we would be just uh, jumping into it now as you can see we're also streaming live on twitch so make sure to check it out or join our discord channel links are in the description below so guys this is going to be our um second try unfortunately i just failed and um i personally think I'm not too sure if we can beat floor 2 with it. I think it should be possible with uh, some decent RNG, but I think floor 3 might be not possible. Another thing as well is, um, if you guys are not able to beat floor 2, you should definitely not do wolves unless you have all the relics from um, bird or deer already, as I would rather recommend you guys to do those because um, it's much better to get uh, the 6 guaranteed plus 1 than just maybe 2 of this new one. Um, but if you are desperate in order to get the new ones, hey, that's totally up to you. Okay, we should uh, focus on the right side. In my opinion, we should just burn cards. So in the first phase, there's no problem at all uh, or on the first floor to deal a lot of damage. And we don't really need that many OP cards. So we don't have to save that much. In floor 2, it's going to look a little bit different. And as I said, I might be not even making a video because I might be not able to beat it. But for now, um, this is going to be the first turn. And now we jump onto the second turn now. So, okay, very, very nice. Um, I kind of like the card draw. So what we're going to do is definitely we should probably use the strip. Um, we should probably just burn this. We burn this. And I would say we're going to burn one of the list heals because we have a two star list here already. Um, and we want to maximize our card draw. The best would be if we're going to be able to um, draw a drain because uh, obviously we want to drain the boss or the right side boss so that we don't get ranked down and lose the ult um okay we actually do have a drain very very good and i think he only attacks um three times or he only uses three skills which means he shouldn't have the um ult yet which is a very very good thing so let's see um for now what we're going to do since there's no one no one of them is buffing we can just um use this already we can just merge this for now i would say we should be also ulting here and probably um, burning the AOE of Melee in order to deal some little damage we might be um, actually killing next round. I will see. Um, obviously, since we do have a drain, we should probably stall here one more turn just to basically get back some ult gauges of Liz, for example. Also, our cards are kind of terrible right now. Okay, so... Um, the only dilemma we have right now, the only problem we have right now is I'm not sure... If we are going to actually be able to deal some damage, I really hope we can going to deal some damage because there's the stance up. But yeah, so we should just burn this, I would say, for now. Um, we're going to use this. We're going to use this. And maybe I'm debating right now if we should just cleanse. Then we will guarantee to deal the damage. So we should just do this. Um, I should probably just now just do this. And let's just burn this as well. So hopefully we're going to deal a decent amount of damage. Else I'm debating if we I should just burn the ult of... Um, of Meliodas next round because basically if we use the Meliodas ult that will be helpful so we did 10k damage I think yeah we could have dealt the damage even with the attack down but hey who knows um better safe than sorry so here now the card was very insane like the melee cards they are really really good so I I would say actually I will use the ult I will use the ult we're gonna move this away for now the thing is, the ult will only deal 30% max. So I think we need to use this ult as well. Um, if we don't kill, no problem. Because basically the ult will drain. So we can just burn this. So basically it should work like this. So if the ult does like no damage at all, then we should be still fine. But um, since the stance is gone, um, here as you can see, he would have lost the ult gauge because he had a 2-star card. Okay, very nice. Um, now what we're going to do is we're definitely going to ult here. Okay, the cards are really beautiful, by the way, guys. We need to use one card in order to deal another damage cap. So I should probably uh, rather just ult here. We should use this. 
and then use this basically um getting all the stacks of melee we want and then we do this the only unfortunate thing is that we don't have a list card at all um we kind of want to get the list ult back but um yeah and he's definitely not on our side so here as you can see as long he deals a 10 percent melee will guaranteed kill i mean as long he has enough stacks and he has more than enough stacks as you guys can see so um we got the best passive this is perfect so i think this is a very very sexy and smooth run just that we still don't have a list card like what the fuck where 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 are the list cards at so i'd say what we're going to do is we double cleave here because the thing is um the right side unit only takes 20 percent damage um i would say we're going to move this here and then we are going to deal one time the damage cap on the left side already um which is a 30 percent so hopefully we deal enough damage so let's see what how much damage we're gonna deal here um okay this was the damage cap very very good can we deal the damage cap with a one star cleave as well so very close but unfortunately not so here here we didn't even deal the damage cap so um i think Golda is definitely the superior unit basically because um he increases permanent stats which is going to be super helpful and sometimes when you do have his maximum health um he's going to increase even more but hey um it's still a i would say for now a decent alternative um for gotha but not 100 not as good so what we should be doing now is probably um we are going to do this no we don't have the melee ult that is horrible but we can get the melee ult if we are going to just single target here double single target here uh, double aoe here we have his ult and we should probably just use the strip first so we are going to use this uh strip here um damn this is such a hard decision right now because we don't want to let this merge so we're going to do this we're gonna do this we're gonna single target here in order to deal a lot of damage basically because um the right side unit is most of the times much much tankier so the pierce card though um they do quite a lot of damage thanks to the lilia most likely so um it definitely has the pro and cons and um it's pretty cool with a rank down that you have a chance to basically um remove some stuff as well and i think we kill here with eventually full health it depends on how much actually yeah we we can actually kill with a full health so i'm pretty sure um the right side minion dies if we're going to ult with melee holders which is actually a bad thing because then um it's harder to beat the left dog but what we're going to do for now is definitely we need to heal we are going to ult and i think um with this ult and also the melee holders ult we should be able to clear him up even though um he gets the immediate stat increase already um so here as you can see it, this is quite a lot of damage so bam bam he should be dead already and if not we still had a melee single target so for floor one um it definitely was much much easier now after i had the second try so i was actually planning on um showing you guys floor two as well but the problem about floor two is with this team um lilia two star card patiences and it even patience us without the defense up without the stands which means um the lilia drain the, uh, the 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 idea of lilia drain for floor two doesn't work at all so i would advise you guys not to use this team at all because here um let me just see uh how much how much is the difference here so 150 150 so if we just use this here right now you can basically see the right side if it if it patience us here right now already it won't work it won't fucking drain that's why I just fuck this idea this team is unfortunately dog shit at least for floor two um i mean it still works but the lilia is not really gonna work out um for floor one if you only want to look for beating floor one that works totally fine but i would still rather use a different unit instead